at their own pace. We're about to have an apps pop into three here. Okay. About to get spicy. Brandon's got the perfect setup for this. Okay, that's not ideal. Far from it. Good flashes and frags. Roy with two, but actually crucial, managing to pluck Fasher from the air before he could commit. That bomb's now in front of Pitt. Flash from Thomas. Did that USP at Good angle for the weapon. Most definitely. But three positions now spotted. Yeah, so now it's going to be Nikodos crawling short side, crucial, responsible. It's all about this next engagement. And it's oh. Nikodos that beheads crucial. All falls apart for Into the Breach. And it felt like Fnatic's round from the get go there, really. Bro, now and Molotov for good measure. Now, there may not be a full commitment behind this, but it does look like they're going to send Mezzi in. Having a little looky loo and gets another one for good measure. So vaults down, bombsite should be there. Roy's actually caught a lot of flack on that. Might want to be a little more passive. Rowan has a nade here. Yeah, and he's in a position to throw it. Crucial from that coffin's position. They heard that pin pull. And now Fasher going for the plant. Will this nade do significant damage? It's a little late now. Crucial's oh. found one, oh. two on the P250. Fasher can't handle and overwhelmed. That is gonna feel very good. The Dutchman a double to get that close right sure that damage was great but this is ahead of the smoke not ready for it roy back turn oh. the second brilliant crims can't do anything the nade just lands and in they come the swarm of into the breach and that's a massive round early the here as well ability. top mid cold clear they uh, looking for back roy back oh. and he's found him with the awp crims to recede they are regrouping it's a smoke on fascia in the long side now and a good Shot out of Thomas, they're even better out of Vault, and now they know where Crims is. Is the 1v3 realistic? Crucial last seen long. Looking for the bomb. Crims has mollied himself and the chicken. Oh, and now the AWP identified here. Oh! oh, crucial. Sent to an early bedtime by Crims. A big game player, and no bigger game than this. It's up against Cypher. Opting for the Deeg, the audacity for that one shot, headshot. Getting cheeky with it there. A big clutch for Cypher. Conversation around players who are new on our screens here. Yeah, we saw uh, Maui bringing up his RMR stats compared to where he's been so far here in the Legends stage. And I'm not, you know, I don't think anyone's particularly surprised he hasn't been able to exactly replicate that level yeah. of form. It was a, a very difficult field of competition. A very different field. There's less fortified here for the hit. Yeah, good frag back. Mezzi's gone. Still, maybe that's going to ask some questions of what's happening at A. Thomas, one. Needs more. Gets Crims and nearly another. He could finish it on the USP and he does as well. Thomas, that could be the round. A beautiful multi-kill out of the Brit. Gets the bomb down and the round out of touch for Nikodos. Yeah, really well handled there. This was some save guns and what they could buy around it. So essentially a force by there for Into the Breach. And Thomas, a bit of a journeyman as far as the UK counter. The match has started. We see some shooting. Oh, it's only going a few centimeters from the players. Oh, this grenade may end this match. This the explosion in. It's a hit. What's happening? Did he run out of ammunition? What will he do now? It's a magazine. Incredible. And we have the winner. Our winner gets a box with incredible skins from Keydrop. We also have something special for all the viewers. With the above promo code, you get 50 cents to start with and 10% bonus from deposit. It's interesting. I think they're hoping that by Vault taking this forward stance, they're going to overlook sandbags. <gasps> oh, he could be a dead man. Vault needs to stay active. Fnatic are coming, gunning for this position. Molly will spread all oh, the extinguish. He should still be gore, and he is. Fasha, good awareness. And again, the B-side opened courtesy of Fasha. Chalk this one up to him. They are coming, waiting for the perhaps the masking of the sound. And here they do start their commitment. Crucial bounding into the site. And not really willing to push any further into the Interesting. unknown. Interesting. All right. Well, fair enough. We've had seven rounds go back and forth in... Uh... A second game within this round now is every frag they get. They're all get. playing in the fade. They want banana control. They're going to come and fight this in a second. Okay. Nikodos. Wow. Perfect position for it. Handles the aggression. Despite the dink as well. Scrap of health left on the Dane, but everything's fine and should shake out. Thomas, he's got no armor on this M4, but he's going to give it a look in. Does some great damage onto Roy. So two members of Fnatic now within that one single bullet. He does finish the job. Thomas, huge from Thomas. 
limited. Rounds here now as but well. But still All fragging. three on the site. Fnatic, this could be a bit of a fumble tripping over their shoelaces. As it's more from Thomas. The unstoppable, the insatiable. Three frags from him, and it's crucial that wraps it all up. That is naughty. Uh, the MP9 on the Bauki now coming over, picking up the rifle, and just being able to have so much impact from the back of the site. And two of the rounds Fnatic have lost in the six, uh, sorry, in the ten rounds we've played so far, have been against these lighter buyers. Remember the P250 round, and Cypher loves that one. Felt the wrath of this into the breach. You cannot underestimate a squad like this. Pushing and fragging. Mezzi's gone. Crucial once more. And he's got it as well. Getting really awkward. So awkward. Crucial takes all three. Monstrous. On Banana. Crim's surely got nothing left here. But it is just crucial. That's all it really takes. A quad kill from the Dutchman to finish off this T side. Let's watch it again from Crucial's POV. They're throwing bodies at the problem though, aren't they? Like they, they do not want to allow Fnatic to set up and play out these mid rounds. Crucial just coming in and mowing them down. And there's just so many bodies that into the breach have to really push and fight with. They bring everybody over. We lost that opener. Now let's just come over and fight them top banana. Let's not give them this space. <laughs> Sacrifices elsewhere and Vault. Look at the flashes. Oh, they won it. They barrage it and they charge it. Cypher does go down. Vault for the response and a nade from Thomas. Good. Nikodos could have another here as they just run through the smoke. A gray screen for Vault. Now fades to black. Roy Molotov the way. Crucial to advance off the back of this. I like the chances. Rollin robbed. Didn't finish his meal onto Roy. Leaves him in a 2v4. And Thomas, he would need a magical double. That's too little. They have the sight. They have the round. And Fnatic now heading... Because it's not like at any point it was just a string around the lost bonus Three built rounds. up, right? Yeah, yeah, you just you think, oh, we played so many rounds with MP9s or lower weaponry. Teams that uh, were never quite at the top. Aurora. Yeah, do the Aurora. Yeah, ecstatic. Yeah. There's a pick. Ooh, Vash is gone. And Here's on the retreat. The yeah, turn. That's lovely. Crimson, he saw a window and he leaps through it. Straight into the site. That was the solo hold of the A site. Have to take a gamble in these type of circumstances, and you have to go for a round like Ten this. Seconds. Nice shot from Thomas. Bomb will go down with just a couple of seconds to spare. Long going to be smoked on off. That will limit their options. That smoke might make it easier for this apartment's fight into what site against Mezzi here. Oh, Thomas. Charged in, and it looks great for the 10th. There it is. It's Mezzi to secure it. Fnatic, they will be happy with that one. A string of three to close out their T side. Crims with a flash to help out his A defenders, but they're wrapping his side. Oh, that's a Crim that special. Bomb Cypher completely removed. And Nikodos clean as you like onto Rala. This could be perfect from Fnatic. Not a single point of damage done to the black and yellow. Black and yellow? Black and orange. Excuse me. Mr. Khalifa came into my head for a moment. It's all right. Black and yellow, black and yellow. We might all see colors differently. Who knows? Yeah. Maybe my yellow is your orange. Well, Thomas, again, he's putting up some resistance. Yeah. Big impact from him, but Vault, we need something and we need it now. Nice work. Not going to get it. Combined, Mezzi and Fasha make it look clean. Double again for him. Let's take a look at the scoreboard. How is he hanging? It's Mezzi and the dedication the Augurs had for the game. It's good that they have stuck with Counter-Strike. I was there at that first major just watching on us. Oh, we're watching Ooh. on with Cypher and in Bananas where he does his best work. He sees you and he oh. has a second Cypher. He wanted more and he gets a... Oh, oh. my God, a whole lot more. It costs them crucial, but they've got the light fight, baby. How has he gotten away with that? Tack up into an area like that. They get you pumped up. An individual play. That's what gets everybody excited. But they've already had a bunch of these. Yes, but what they need, Chad, is the second. Uh, after finding something like that, after winning the round, you, you see Nikodos and Roy is in limbo, right? They're like off angles that are being held as players come up procedurally. Messi yeah. flash. Oh, caught out completely. Damn. Nikodos just completely Damn. flattens them. Flash not necessary. Crucial and Cypher. Oh, dead. Molly not swung upon. And we Thomas on a gray screen if he did. A second as well. You can see that's... Ooh. Lulled Thomas into another fight with Nikodos and a triple from the Dane. Job done. Yeah, nice work right there with that top and under retake. Fantastic. As now Mezzi will pick up yet another Rallon dead. It's just Vault. Yeah, some would say too much to get past. Three-man setup of this site. Nice opportunity to isolate a jewel, but it's gone now. And with 13 bullets, make it even 11. He's got his back turned to Fasher. 
So, good conversion back. Fnatic, they will post their... Be expecting it in play at all. They don't have a Molotov to flush out Crims. Smoke. Not going to be cleared. Cypher dead. Oh, and Mezzi in support. Perfect. On the Fnatic lockdown. Trying to bait the shot. Vault. Oh, and crucial. They've combined and making a round out of this now. Timing. It's Roy with a perfect timing. They have their backs to turn. Oh. Crucial is dead. And Vault could be followed. It's all onto Roy. Elevated is Rallin. And a ninth secure. You can see just this... They're going. They're going through. Roy should have at least one here. Not cleared. Not cleared. Overlook completely. Cypher and him are side by side. It will be caught. Nikodos will finish him off. Still no idea about Roy. It's horrible. Look at this. Triple from Crims, but they were just choked out. You could see very few options in front of them. From Fnatic, I'm talking in this game in its entirety. Oh. You could see nobody wanted to go for Into the Breach. They're understanding what was on the other side. The flames, well, it was the bullets that was their undoing. And the war cry from Fashion now getting the better. And this one's going to be a quick domination. Nikodos spots out a hip. Fires off the shot. And it's actually missed his second as well. So now they are running him down. Boys. Yeah, Roy. Oh, wow. No, they, no, get no, 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 no. they get a plant. Not just that. They have an orb. They have yeah, the sight. Crucial could actually hit one more. Oh, my God. He has. Into the breach on the full eco. A guarantee. We called it a guarantee. A certainty that this was 15. And crucial another. Nikodos is orb used against them. And Fnatic, they lose it. To get consecutive CT side of rounds. You had two rounds where all five stayed alive. And then you lose to a P250 upgrade. He yep. ain't missing these. And just overwhelmed the swarm. This should never happen. Oh, never happen. Takes down Crimson. He builds a whole round out of it. You can catch the timing through. He's actually just walked straight through. Great awareness as to what was Huge going delay. down. They've got to go short. 40 seconds. And running into Fasha. A double. In wonderful burst from his AK-47, five bullets, two headshots, and more from Fasher from that pit side. Eddie. He is a very steady rifle. The euphoric feeling of winning a, a full eco to now going back into the guns. The majority of the rounds that Into the Breach have won in this game feel like they have been with the lighter buys, the worst weaponry. B rush. Rush B. No stop. Charging. Now Roy turns tail immediately. And Nikodos does put Ralin down. Crucial though. One back. Oh, and Vault dead. It's Mezzi as well to strike. It's all falling into place with Mezzi spamming him down. And it's the Brit to throw those boys down a peg. 16 to 12. That's cool. Conditional util there. And Cypher, oh, he's got a lot on his plate. A crouch clear straight into the dual Berettas. So a dreamy start for Cypher. They're still coming. They are. Three monster. Can Cypher build any more out of that? Great util. Really limits his options. He can't quite get the crosshair in the right place, but Vault can. Does go looking for more and gets a face full of Glock from Mezzi. Can this 2v4, now 2v3, turn on its head? That's up to Crimson Mezzi. You can see our Ops team keeping track of Rallon, who's once again up to his flanking. Good stuff. Oh, Ooh, and the click of the mouse. Good for it. 99 damage inflicted straight to the head of Rallon. Call that one a goosh, but not around. Crims. He's looking to pick up that bomb, but he has to get through Thomas and Crucial first. Thomas, confirmed presence and more damage inflicted back. Crims junk down, oh. two HP on one more bullet, will do it. And Thomas collect. Missed Molly. Good golly, smokes down. Couple of shots do connect. It's Thomas that gets the bomb carrier. Fasher frustrated boost. Exciting as Roy's caught as well over the smoke from Crucial. Into the breach, actually playing this one very con constrained, or rather restrained. Thomas could check that one out. Covered by Mezzi. And a good headshot back, a 2v3 now. Winnable. Most definitely. Nikodos looking for lethality. Vault's got him, there's too many. And into the breach, they keep it going, keep it flowing. Chris, you're never gonna be 2-2, playing Fnatic. Playing CSGO. And playing CSGO. Oh, and crucial, onto Nikodos. That's his fourth. Death for Nikodos, yet to see him in the feed in a positive manner. And Rahlan, he's about to get a test. He's made, woof, be ready for one, but not the second. Big from Fasha, dink from Rahlan makes. And a good setup to lock down this B snipe. Oh, you see in Cypher's uh, routine on that crosshair. He's looking in the right direction, and only the one. Vault will finish it off, and just like that, the fourth round feels imminent. You ain't got the HP for this one, Fasha. 
and Vault opts for Sandbags as his final resting place. Investigating short side, Thomas has the monster walk. And now with the dismantled boost, they will investigate. How far does Vault push the issue? Oh, elbow spotted, good headshot, takes down Nikodos, Roy responds, and more required out of Crucial. He's gonna get run down, beautiful play from Roy. He won't be expecting another, will ya? And Volt, or rather, Rahlan, he's taken down Messi, he's taken the whole team down. Aggression, the remedy. They might be able to find the bomb if they keep going towards Crimson's location. Pushing the playground, pushing the issue, looking to keep their foot on the throat oh. of Fnatic, and they are ablaze. Fnatic weren't prepared to, or weren't able to process what was been thrown their way. And now look at it. It's completely them different towards B, setup. right? They don't want to test any A aggression. Here they come. Okay. Oh, Cypher. And it doesn't matter because Volt and Thomas are here to lock it down. They're in the right place in back-to-back -back rounds. Damn, I'm uh, impressed here with just some of the, the way that they've been able to read the game and be ahead of Fnatic maneuvers here. Nikodos low, Crims joining the party up short. Both of them won't be long for the world. As, oh, it almost... It was a flawless one there for Thomas. He goes down, but... Oh, maybe it wasn't the boost. Maybe it was just the barrels, Murray. Regardless, here we go. Yeah. Volt flash. Executed. It's Cypher that steps up in response. And a three-man spray. Roy gone. Round one. Unless Nikodos has got anything crazy to say or do, Rollin should have him. And he does deliver. Options for the Orp. Cypher cheering him on, trying to get... Overpass. Sure, they, they had a competitive one. We saw it against Liquid. We were impressed by the way in which Into the Breach were competitive against Liquid in good form with OC in top form. But then you look at Fnatic, you say it's one of their, if not their best map, Overpass. It lends itself to their kind of procedural default heavy style. Oopsies. Yeah, oopsies. And against these Tech Nines, pace, this Oliver level. Run, miss no scope. Rollin trying to bail them out, but they lose them both. And just like that, Already, face palms imminent. Thomas and Volt desperate to keep hold of this. This slippery rope as he tries to dump some util, slow him down. A good spray, but damage dealt. Thomas stands his ground. Behind them. Needed one onto Mezzi. He gets them both down. Cypher from behind. That's the bomb. Can he, he save them? Side side. Can he save them? One he needs another. Spotted out on the site. Knows where he is. Oh, Cypher on his next lazy clear. He could be caught. It's all in the timing here. Mezzi has to finish A. Eh? Well played from Cypher so far. This would be huge from Cypher. Oh! He looks away! And that is Messi saving Fnatic with the 4K. Grabs the AWP. He loses two. It was Cypher looking for that 1v2 to bring it back. 1v3, do excuse me. He takes down Nikonos on that flank first. That's great. The bomb's loose here. Oh, Just man. Just the timing. Just the timing there. Uh, the timing on that one. Thomas, Vault. A smoke short does nothing. They're in, these crab walked players through. And Fasho with a great headshot to start it off. Another would be crazy. That was the bomb. They have that to could plant. be the round. They need to plant now. One no more. Time. One more. No, no time. time. No time at all. Nikodos, just for survival, looking to run him down after time. He fights his way into survival. Keeps hold of everything. To join up with the rest of the team as they do spot out Rallon. Into B they go. Hinging on this first defensive fight. Good chip damage. It's Crims. Using that barrel's position, but heard by the flame. Cypher aware. Four members of Fnatic on the other side of that smoke, and it's Rahlan. He draws blood first. More built upon it by Cypher. Out of the door now. Yeah, they're limited. Need one final flourish. Good catch. Mezzi continues to impress. It's Volt that gets the bomb on the floor. Advantage for this defense extended as Rahlan again features in impactful frags, and that's going to feel good. Like the 2-2 has been called into play. Crucial. Gonna get on the end of that fishing rod. He's the bait. He's looking for some info. Oh. Blindsided, surely. Okay, he's got How's he alive? I don't How's he alive? I don't know. He neither does he. They gotta run him down. He surely. has to stand. Stand and bang. One would be great. Hard ass of the orb. And oh, bodyguarded by Rahlan. He actually gets away with it. Still gets the frag. And now Fnatic. Red alert. They need three access three. to this site right seconds. now. Right now. Molly's in. What have you got? Rahlan, another frag. Can he save them? Defend the side again, make it 11. Yes, they can. Cypher establishes the crossfire and it's Rahlan leaping to the lead 11 as a tr And does get that smoke down. It's a good time At to drop it. 35 seconds. It's a very good time to drop it. And Volt's rotating over as well. Into the stack once more. Crucial. He goes forward. 
And he gets one for free. Fasha moonwalking into the scope. Nice one back. Crims. They need a lot more than where that came from. And Messi might overlook this position. Distracted. And Thomas, he'll zip up the body bag. He's got himself the bomb. And they're looking like the round is in the right place. Everything coming together beautifully. 12. This is getting crazy. What happens when you're a team that has a lot of default style in your play? Where's the flare? Where's your, where's your can opener? Where's your crowbar? Where, where's the player who you're going to turn to to say, hey, Go Root to this force. area of the map, let's Root flush force. you in, let's take the fight. Who's the exciting player on this roster? Well, Nikodos can get flicky with the orb. Their careers, Chad. They've been at it for years, but this game means so much to every single one of them. Just denied again. They tried something risky, they tried to send a fight. Cypher takes down Crims once more. Juices flowing, Nikodos disrupting. A dominating double. To give Fnatic a chance at the second here. Oh, he, he wins that duel. The second bullet, not quite on the money from Rollins M4, but Thomas, oh, he knows one's there. Nikodos finished off and spots another as well. He knows where both are. Yeah, heard short, knows monster. Thomas relaying that information. They have the health advantage, crucial to rotate through. He brings the fight to Roy and he can finish it. Ah! Oh, oh! He continues to frag and that is 14. 19 for Thomas. He was making impact across the map while pulling the strings of this squad. Uh oh, they're pushing into a lot of players here. Hello, Fasha. He's done a lot with that USP. You send Roy in, he kicks up a fuss, but it's Fasha that manages to leave with the advantage for the squad. If he's brave, if they get info on the monster positioning, Fasha at low enough to fall to body shots. Oh, headshots, crucial. One, overlooks the position and a quick response from Volk. It's nice from Mezzi. He gets himself right back into position in time. Now that smoke does provide a little cover. They regroup, they want to play the advantage, play this 1v2, gets the bomb, gets away. They're going to run him down. Vault, needed oh, one, oh, oh, oh. none of it. Five towards the banana position. Ah, uh, the Brits out there, they're all getting the flashbacks now. Uh, Nikodos is probably going to have some PTSD if he dies against the pistols again, don't yeah, forget. Don't miss another Nikodos. No, no, no. They, I mean, it has enabled them to get a little closer, but Mezzi's not allowing it to spiral. They've got Roy on the site, Fasher and Crims are on their way, and everything's going to fall into place. A single dig, maybe their best hope. Thomas now added to the naughty list, and it is a good headshot. Nikodos will go down to the crucial dig, still making it as costly as they can, hoping that they overstep the mark here. And Roy set up for success. Doesn't get the double. Rather makes it costly again. So they're still chipping away at this Fnatic defense. The funds in... It, it, now, if this was, you know, two more known teams, right, uh, in terms of the upper echelons, I'm talking experience and pressure matches. Yeah. I, I'm not, obviously, Into the Bridge have played a lot of games and these players we've seen uh, in different points throughout their career. But in terms of the pressure in this... Close angle. It worked for Crims once. Better weapon for the job this time as well as it's Fasha combined perfectly, just like that mincemeat made of Into the Breach. Crucial needs to save this here. Seven seconds, needs to back off. Should be given the good graces to do so. And there's another round for Fnatic. So another, at least even exchange to start off the round, but Nikodos more than ready for that maneuver there. And I, I guess it makes sense when you know that the orb saved, how many plays do you have? And you have someone pushing to punish that space. Look at the frags come through, Mezzi. Activating, so aware of his opponent. Beautiful work. The Cypher, yeah, pushing the smoke, actually quite ballsy from him on that dig. He's nearly got another one, he does. Find Roy, nearly, oh, he does. Catch Mezzi, we doubted him. So did the observers. And yeah, that's a nasty miss. He's gonna be punished for that one. Crucial had a chance to level it out into the 2v2, but now extended Cypher's chance to dwindle. So ahead of him. And he's still wanting more Deagle headshots. A valiant attempt. Okay. Taking that aggressive space, it's really going to contain you. You can see Nikodos pushing long side. Mezzi's got three on his plate right now. And lovely start. Needs the trade. Cypher provides. Good trade. And now from Roy's Great position, trade. they've lost weapons and they've lost territory. Look at the map. They're surging forward towards the A site. Fasha panicking in the rotate. Does have to get in. Eats the flash, but does manage to tuck into truck. Spotted. Not traded. Cypher again. He racks up a third. This is where it falls apart. It is a missed shot from Nikodos. And now all onto Crims, noted and known in a one versus three. To stave off our boatload of map points.
He's calculated his crims, but this one just seems like the probabilities all lie into the breach. Looking for trouble. Nice headshot. Thomas down. Nearly another. Crucial will hold on. It's a triple from Cypher. An impactful one at that. We saw on Crucial finding great success on these kind of later clears. Wow, he's really forcing the issue here, Nikodos. And Vault. Big <gasps> miss. Missed it! And he gets punished. Nikodos down. That could have the round red and looking problematic. As Cypher and Vault rack up some more. Fasher and Roy to save him. Oh, they're planning safe. Roy's flank means nothing here. And Vault's got the cover. Still potential for more bloodshed and success as into the breach. Just need to find Roy. They've done everything they needed to in this battle for top eight in Paris. And it looks like it's going the distance. Nade on the low HP, no problem for into the breach. We will see three. Vertigo locked in. The defense for Fnatic into the breach on the attack and a lot of utility in the mix. Okay, Cypher in the feed. A quick headshot between the eyes, too, to start off proceedings. He is the brunt and the brute of this attack. Jeez. It's all Cypher. Take them all. Starting with a bang, starting as he means to go on. He is within touching distance of making history for the UK. They already have. Look at him go. He wants the ace and he can't. It's it all him, baby. And that's got to feel good. They crumble under one man's Glock. And look at the speed, an absolute demon. This map is perfect for someone that loves to hold W through the flashes, through the smokes. Well, that's yet to come. This is the pistol round. It's all about the aim. And this kid's got it in buckets and spades. Mince me. Look at this, Fasher. Didn't have a chance. He's jumping around. He's clicking his Glock. He's taunting them. To flash through as they double nade behind the sandbag. And here he comes. Yeah, he's running and gunning. For it, great catch from Roy, but traded, what? A second out of the Thomas, Mac 10 Just when you lost Cypher, it's Thomas that fills his place for the fragging. He snatches the pace and the M4, and another from the Brit. Just a triple, him. a triple out of Thomas. Marlon responsible for Crims, vault for Mezzi. Mezzi, ooh, he hit the shot. Vault had the better weapon. A headshot exchange puts it all onto Crims. And he's been caught out. Rollin collects. And the first gun round. Depp of this journey. They're pushing. Nikodos and Fasher short side. Good awareness. Rollin. He gets one. He's running out of bullets. And he's lost a teammate or two. Awkward now. Look at their health. Oh, dear. With Crucial and Rollin so low. They're trying to hope Vault could get something done through the smoke. This. Fnatic. They don't even need the rifles. This is a swing and a half in momentum. Crucial. He spots out Crims, but with 20 seconds, he needs to find them both, and he'll take the bomb B. They can just chase him down here. They got the number advantage. He's going to try and plant. No time to really fake it. We'll just have to punch in the digits. Ooh, they're going to run him down. He gets off the bomb, and down he goes. Would have loved the plant. Redeploy will not have that same gap, and you can see oh, the other fade. Oh, clearing. Knows the gap. Oh. Great find. Cypher wants him. Bloodlusting into the orc for the equalizer. Can't get the second. Good work from Roy. He'll hold on for Fnatic. It's crucial. Misses his shot. That's a miss that he's not going to be punished for. And we'll be able to isolate the headshot box or force him out. Distraction. And that's the flank from Mezzi coming through. But down goes Fasher. Down goes Fasher. Mezzi activating. They're not ready for this. Crucial. I think he saw him. Catches a glimpse. They react in time. The bomb now down. And it looks like it's another round into the breach. Five to the Counter-Strike world here. The playoffs are the major. Now you got to reel it in and so do they. This is uh, still going to be a tough game to close here, but they are running with that momentum from Overpass. And look at the hype. Fnatic couldn't be quieter now, but what are you going to celebrate? You're not winning anything. And the things might calm down for a moment. Crucial trying to find a way in. We know he's got those wall bangs in him. Looking for more is Roy. Thomas down in the dumps and more there as well. There we go. That's what you were hoping to see. And confidence there as well. We'll extinguish their molly. We'll take the fight. We'll stall them out and continue to repeat. So finally, some of that individual brilliance from Fnatic being put on. That could work out nicely. You've got to get past Nikodos short. There's the nade. 
You'd need a whole lot more fascia next up. He can it out and they're gonna get it down. That's nice, a plant. Okay, that's all they'll get. But it is extra funds. And so the fun can continue for Into the Breach as Fnatic will wrap up a second. Understandable. Nate does nothing. Molly's great. Forced away, smokes are in too. Bundled together. Shoulder to shoulder, he had his knife out, he's jumping around! Facing shots, Crimson's got his Scorper safe. And they have the advantage. Rounds in B, they can drop back. Oh they my can God. drop back right now. Crucial is going to be a race. It's a power position. They need to get this plant down. Oh. Crucial can kill them all. Okay, hold on. He's keeping boots planted. The bomb, it's going to make it in time. Crucial, he just has to survive. They're looking for him. He's even ready for it. Nikodos about to walk into the scope and another for Crucial. This is something special as a ninth comes through. Crim still, oh, <laughs> oh the orb and Mezzi. Yeah, you found the bomb. You got to get through these two. Considering the straight, Rana will turn, traded by Vault, and sent 52 floors down. But this is miraculous Counter-Strike here. You love to see it. The final timeout forced. All four again in the first half of play. And I said Crucial can kill them all. Well, he almost did. Just getting to play around the power position on A while the bomb's planted on B. An Orpah's dream. Take those fights. It doesn't even matter. And they are in the dumps. Putting them in the bin. Enter this as a team. They are riding this emotion, this oh. adrenaline. And, oh, Crims with a push. Double. Rollin, one. Mezzi, at least another. Big but it's trade. Paul. He's ready. And there's more. More in the feed, Nikodos down, it's up to Roy, and it's a great shot. Maybe he can get a rifle. Maybe there's something to be said about this one, but Thomas doesn't seem to think so through the smoke. To the to the top eight is FaZe, Ents, and Fnatic. You can't question that. I, I challenge you to question that. In this best of three, all three maps, and Fash is dead again. 11, as Juve has to contain himself. Salvage something here. They've got the guns out to do so. They need to stall out Cypher. He can't keep having this space on ramp. A statement needs to be made, and they've changed things up. Fasher here to help them fight. Good catch. Fasher does deliver, and it's Roy as well. That's the ramp shutdown you need. Fnatic's rounds have come when this is how the rounds begin. Crucial, he's the one to step up in the aggressive Nobody's play. looking! That's ridiculous. He's gotten away with murder. Perfect right now. The U2 is bang on. Those are the two key positions you have to clear. Oh. Now here comes the smokes. The headshot molly for Vault available here as well. Double nade. Don't better. worry about the molly. God, it's perfect. You got one nade, sure. It will stop the bomb plant. No, it won't. Tell a lie. It was someone else. Vault down. And can Mezzi give something for Fnatic to work with? A fourth would go a long way in the grand scheme. As this is the only map Fnatic have to battle for the playoffs. And only three rounds to boast. It's Messi in the clutch, a one-on-one. -on -one. He's holding it. Crucial, the Orpa. He needs to finish oh, it. No! Oh, no! Oh! He does it in time! 12 into the breach, looking to make Britain proud. Fnatic, the pedigree this organization boasts. And yet, it's into the breach that come into this final half of play with their heads held high. Point four seconds on that defuse. And they deny the fourth. If they could really seal the deal with something as trivial as a pistol round, they've played thousands of them, but it's this just one. Ego. They're all here, Alex. Thomas has a flash. Oh, oh no, with Crucial's a flash. got a headshot. He has to move now. It's all about this Thomas flash now. They're going to skirmish. They're going to fight. Thomas will flash high and they'll push. Watch this. Oh, Rollins been caught. Nice work from Crimson on that molly. This is a nice off angle for the plant. Trying to fight them through it. It's Crucial. Another one pushing. Oh, Crucial. So much damage. Has he done enough? It seems it may be so. With only 35 HP in Ikados. Has to be perfect. Fnatic watching through their fingers as their spot in the playoff slips through it. All four of the players dead silent, hoping, praying, finding any deity they could possibly wish upon a star that they can take this round and start off the comeback for those playoffs. Oh! And it's Nikodos that injects some hope as he gets away from the first shot vault. He has them health, Nikodos has the aim. It's 40 seconds, this battle of brains can vault, launch into the breach, into a quick close. He repositions, he takes the fight, and Ikados falls into the breach, one step closer. Crucial. Active as a player since 2013. Oh, the very start. He's been having a crack for it's many his years. his first major, and look at him, 17 and six. He's flying so high now as he simultaneously 
breaks Fnatic's hopes and dreams. There's nothing left for them here. They're gonna have a gunny. Decisions to be made. Utility exchange. It will be A. Starting to gravitate back now. Nikodos, you should have this, He's Frank. not clearing Sandbag. Really? Oh, it Sandbag. Yeah, Fran has a look, though. He doesn't. Hiding behind the Sandbags. So much potential to strike. He's been spotted out. He'll activate one on that MP9. Keeping himself alive only for a moment. As Mezzi will relieve him of his life. Awkward for Thomas and Cypher. You got a kid on Cypher, sure, but... Three versus one and a bit. Yeah, Thomas does go down. And now a 1v3 goes 1v2 goes one on one. UK versus UK. And it's Messi that holds on. Denies Cypher from what would have been euphoric. Just trying to line it up through a smoke. It's the tiniest of details right here. But Roy, that's a great shot onto Vault. Drawn one back. And then they finish towards the side. This was the attempt from Cypher here. But Messi stands strong. And he's been doing a decent job for Fnatic throughout. A really nice close try, round, nice and you can try. see the team knows how close they were. Solid start, Cypher chunked. Gonna get caught off by this boost here. Thomas at the top. Yeah, not ready for this. There's a beautiful double, make it three. Roy lost the duel as well. Fnatic, just evaporate the drop of a hat. Hard. Three frags in the bag. Yeah. I don't see a way back no, in. No, it's really hard, especially if there was no push from Cypher. Him considering you saw him starting to make his way out on that catwalk. It could have been a fight for Fascia. Voltoro's headed over now. Rowan's still in middle. And Alex, we're still at the early stage of this game. This is only round number four. And if this goes 15 in their favor, next round's only 1,900 loss bonus for Fnatic. They're screwed. They are screwed. They're not going to have the finance. They didn't leave themselves any room for error. No margin to make a mistake. 15 now secure for Into the Breach. Just one more round away. There's a little bit of util. There's nothing in the mix. And this tower, this Titan topples them. You have to keep, you have to give more and more props to the Into the Breach CT setups. It's always something Fnatic getting caught off by on overpass. Rylan. He's been flanking up a storm throughout the legend stage, and this one can take him to the champions. Into the breach. Just need a couple more frags. Crucial. Crucial indeed. He has to be a component of this if they want it here and now. The bomb has gone down. Fnatic looking to reposition for the post plant. Talking it through. Thomas, the leader of men. Opt for a fresh magazine to try and finish it right here and now. And it's a missed shot. Nikodos' scout does nothing. Messi's Deagle, he's trying everything. It's one frag in it. So much damage. Crucial should be a dead man. Smoke could come down. Oh, oh that's I it. think he's done it. Crucial, magnificent in the finish. Has he got it? Oh, he's got it. Oh, Don't you worry about my that. God, you got me scared, Cypher. This is reality, no longer a dream. The celebration into the breach have done what no UK team has done before. History has been made.